you got to shoot through the cracks. Look, we're shooting into a crack. It's hitting that guy way over there. It's bouncing off the walls. It's hitting that dude. It's crazy. What's up, everyone? Danny Lightning back with another War Robots video. Today, we're checking out the brand new robot, Kefri. Crazy tank. He's a durable healer. This thing is such a good support. It's not even funny. We got the brand new machine guns on him. We're going to do a little overview of the robot. We'll take a quick, quick look at the build, and then we'll get into some fun gameplay, guys. All right, so first off, let's check out this robot's abilities. He will bond to an ally and give them uh, more damage more movement speed he'll give him defense points and it will repair your allies so it does say the bond activation is 300 meters to 400 meters so it does seem like when you're too close to your ally it won't bond to them so somewhere between i've noticed somewhere between like two and 300 meters is where it seems like it's starting to bond with people so i'm still trying to figure that one out just a little bit but it says the max distance is 400 so that's a little bit weird I'm having a little bit of weirdness going on with the bond. Sometimes it works really close to your teammates. Sometimes it doesn't. So I'm still trying to figure that one out. We're going to go ahead and run one nuclear amplifier, one balance unit, and one of the brand new repair amplifiers, which is really cool. All right, this thing gives you uh, durability loss, defense points, gray damage restored, and it has 60 stacks. So this thing will stack up 60 times to give you uh, more of this stuff over here, which is really cool. Very cool nuclear amplifier like thing, but this one's for repair instead of damage. So here's the new pilot and basically that new pilot in the end, she her, her special ability just boosts this robot's ability and makes it even stronger, which is super cool. And these are the uh, pilot skills we got on there. We got speed, we got uh, durability, and we got uh, stuff to make our modules last longer and recharge faster, which is really good on this robot. This is the current drum setup we have. We got the Nebula with Suppressor, On Repair Unit Defense, On Repair Unit Defense, and Mild Damage Absorber. Very cool setup for the drone on this guy. And guys, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. That would definitely help me out. So please go do that right now if you don't mind. That would be amazing, all right? And if you can, if you want to be really cool, share this with your friends. Yeah. <laughs> We've also got the brand new Mothership Orion installed, so we're going to test that out as well. We'll make another video on this later, but we're just going to put him on here and see how he does today. All right, and we're going to go ahead and play the very first game that I played. I've probably recorded three or four battles, and unfortunately, I've been matched up with a lot of decent to bad teammates but i think our team did best on the very first battle like i said i'm having a little bit of weirdness with using this guy's ability sometimes it seems to activate uh and attach to your teammates sometimes it doesn't um the description's a little weird with the 300 to 400 meter thing i'm still trying to figure that one out guys but let's go ahead and play that really fun game clip and check out how this guy does all right, so we're dropping in on Shenzhen. We're going to go ahead and grab this guy. We're going to give him a Nebula drone with a suppressor, two on repair defense chips, and one of those purple shield chips, right? And we should be able to shoot anybody and anything that's within 500 meters. Let's try and shoot this guy like who's behind a building or something. Remember, we don't even have to aim with this. Those seem like they're doing some pretty nice damage. Who do I... I'm trying to bond to that guy over there. So right now... Alright, we're just shooting the crap out of these dudes. Let's try and bond to that person. Now these shoot for a really long time. So I'm just firing off into the crowd. I don't even know who I'm hitting, but I'm hitting people, guys. I'm hitting people. Who am I hitting? I don't know. I don't see the bond working. Um, let's go try and get this bond to work. So we might have been too far away, guys. We might have been too far away. So let's go ahead and bond to him as well. All right. So I think we can only bond to one person at a time. We're still figuring out how this bond works. Let's try and bond to that guy. So we're tethered to him, right? We're going to heal him, give him more speed, more defense points. This is going to be a really good robot to help your team, you know, really succeed. 
let's see if we can hit this guy. It's supposed to hit people behind buildings and stuff like that, so... You got to shoot through the cracks. Look, we're shooting into a crack. It's hitting that guy way over there. It's bouncing off the walls. It's hitting that dude. It's crazy. It's crazy. All right. Now, something like this, we might even want to run like a shield breaker on it because we could uh, get get those Fafners from anywhere. All right. We're going to try and attach to this guy here. I don't know where he went, but I think we got the attachment. So this robot seems nice and durable. So far, I'm liking it. So let's attach to that dude. We'll help him out. We'll just fire into these cracks here, and we're gonna we're gonna hit somebody. I mean, you can see the red thing lighting up. We just shoot. We're just shooting, guys. They're bouncing off the walls and doing all kinds of crazy stuff. So let's bond to him again. This dude's coming after me. So we're gonna go ahead and try and get him. These machine guns seem to hit extremely hard. Like I am amazed at how much damage these are doing. Right now, I'm going to say these are probably pretty OP. The robot's healing people like crazy. It's, uh, it's insane. It's insane. So you do got to get somewhat close to your, your teammates to bond to them. But once you got the bond going, it's pretty awesome. Look at that. We're just going <laughs> to... You can watch the bullets, like, shoot around the corner there. <laughs> Jeez. That's insane. All right. We got to let these things reload. So we're going to back off. And we're going to go ahead and shoot at that guy for a minute. Look at that damage, guys. These are crazy weapons. These are crazy weapons. All right. He died. I was about to bond to him, but unfortunately, he died. Where are my teammates all at? There's somebody. I'm going to try to bond to that person. Did it work? I don't see the bond. I, it must have bonded to somebody because it used the ability. Or maybe I was too far away there. You do got to be kind of somewhat close. We're going to hit that guy with the new Orion mothership. I forgot to mention that. We actually have the Orion. So right now, we're just giving ourselves the abilities. I'm going to tell you what. This robot is amazing. This robot is freaking amazing, guys. I am, I am loving this thing. These new machine guns are a little bit much, though. I will say that. They're a little bit much. They are a little bit much. This is crazy. I'm going to tell you what. If you guys get a hold of this thing, you are going to have fun with it. You are going to have fun with it. All right. Let's go ahead and try to tether to this Titan here. We're going to hit our healing module. Don't die. Don't die. Come on. Get him. Get him. There we go. So, yeah, you can only bond to one person at a time. We're going to go ahead and hit the uh, Orion ship. But ba bam Take that, you red turds. <laughs> we got him. We got him. Yeah. All right. I think I'm finally going to go down. I mean, this thing is just kind of... Uh, this thing is lasting forever. We're bonded to... Did we bond? It did not tether to somebody. So sometimes it's tethering to people. Sometimes it's not. I don't know what the deal is with that. All right. There we got a tether. Good, good. I got to pay a little more attention to how this thing does, guys. Oh, they got me. <laughs> well, so I was a little unsure of what this thing did during the game. We were trying it out. We were learning it for the first time. And I'm going to tell you what, if you get one of these, level it up. It is fun. It is good. It is durable. It's going to be a giant help to your team. These things are actually amazing. So, guys, if you have a Kepri, level it up ASAP, okay? Um, I think almost everybody's going to love this thing. I'm going to tell you, any set of weapons you throw on here is probably going to do really good. I don't think you're going to go wrong with any setup on this, honestly. Any weapon setup... As long as they're a decent set of weapons to a good set of weapons, this thing is going to rock it out and be an amazing addition to your hangar. All right, so thanks for watching, guys. You're all awesome. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe, and we will catch you next time, all right? You guys are awesome.